guacamole is a staple for parties, on Taco Tuesday, and it is incredibly simple to make. And today I'm gonna to show you how I make the simplest, tastiest guacamole. So we're gonna start with about two and a half avocados here. We got two large ones and one small one. And we're just gonna get all these out of their skin. Gonna cut around here. Twist it. Take your knife, being careful not to chop off any thumbs or fingers. Tap it in the seed, turn it, that comes out. And get the others done now. Gonna take a regular old spoon, one you might have at the table. Use that to scoop out that guacamole flesh. And if you have any little brown spots that you wanna get out of there, go ahead. This one doesn't look too bad. Now, I just take a fork and I mash it up. If you have some other way you like to mash it, go ahead, but I find a fork just works very easily starts to break it down. If any of you have any great guacamole recipes you want to share, go ahead and leave them down in the comments. I think there's a lot of unique ones out there. This is a fairly basic and simple one, but I've found that the ratios work really well for a just a nice flavorful guacamole with not too many ingredients. I've made it before where you take a couple tablespoons of salsa and mix it in with what you have right here, just the mashed up avocado. It tastes great. All right, now to this, we're gonna add the juice of one lime. We're also gonna add half a teaspoon of granulated garlic and half a teaspoon of kosher salt. We're gonna mix this all together, then we'll taste and see if we need to add any more salt, any more garlic. All right, let's give this a quick taste, see how we're doing. I don't think it needs anything. If you want it saltier or more garlic flavor, you can add more. To me, this has just the right amount of additional flavors to help bring out that great flavor of the avocado. You don't need a lot of extra stuff in guacamole. At least that's my opinion. You can always, like I said, go crazy with it. Add salsa, add jalapenos, I add other things to it. It's really something whatever you want it to be, but if you're looking for just a really good basic, great tasting guacamole that doesn't take a long time to make. I like my recipe. All right, let's plate this up and have a taste with some blue corn tortilla chips. My favorite part of making guacamole is eating guacamole. So we're gonna have a good taste here with some of these blue corn tortilla chips. Take one here, dig in. This is not fancy, it's just good. And recently I did a video on my mom's potato salad and I said, you know, everybody's got a potato salad recipe and they're all the best, and that's true. Guacamole recipes are very individual and there's countless numbers of them out there that are just fantastic. But I wanted to share mine with you today because it is really, really simple, four ingredients. Sometimes people get away with, you know, just the mashed avocados, nothing wrong with that. Maybe add some salt. But I think this is a good balance of flavor and just really brings out that avocado taste. So if you're a guacamole fan like I am and you need a simple recipe, here it is. Four ingredients, takes five minutes to make. You can throw it together right before a party or right before dinner, put it out on the table and you'll have people digging in with the chips and it will be gone in no time. So simple and so good.